I brought in something very exciting for us to study. So don't hold back on your questions. How big is this crate? <laughs> no, that's not yeah, what I... and how do they reinforce the corners? <laughs> what kind of wood is it made of? Poplar? That's a poplar? <gasps> no. Spruce! <laughs> the exciting part is actually what's inside the crate. Ah. We're talking about the packing materials. Ooh, crumpled newspaper? Styrofoam peanuts? Is it bubble wrap? It's bubble wrap. It's not the packing materials! <sighs> As I'm sure you know, rainforests around the world are disappearing. I blame magicians. It's actually big corporations who clear cut the trees for lumber to make crates. No more talking about the crate. In fact, for the rest of the class, no one is allowed to say crate. I rescued one tiny piece of rainforest and had it sent to us, straight from the jungles in the Congo Basin in Africa. Who knows what answers might lie inside this crate? Wooden box. It's not bubble wrap. Okay, what's your name? <laughs> Crap? Some people have the oddest names. Don't you agree, Echo? I do, Derby. <laughs> How long have you been in that crate? <gasps> That's right, I said crate. <laughs> Are you hungry? <laughs> Here you go. Whoa. Look at the way she's eating that fruit ball. Let's see what else he has in his lunch. She seems to think she's an elephant. Could it be that Brap was lost on a jungle safari as a baby and raised by elephants? She's probably scared, confused, in a weak, fragile state. Whoa. Whoa. Did you see that? She broke my nerd toss record. <laughs> ah, I was so distracted by her, I let my collection of heart-shaped helium balloons float away. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Tater, is this gruel? No, we can't afford gruel. That's one part gruel, two parts gruel substitute. What's gruel substitute? Shredded newspaper? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Newspapers full of fiber. Plus this delightful Garfield comic. <laughs> <laughs> to do something about the food. Look, if you have a complaint, I encourage you to use our new suggestion box. Fine. Serve food that's made out of food. <laughs> a few more suggestions and we'll have enough shreds to offer dessert. Can you expect kids to eat this? What choice do they have? It's not like there's another cafeteria around. Now, if you're not gonna eat that, do you mind if I read the front page? <laughs> Newspaper ink found to be toxic to children. Huh. What are we gonna do 
with Brap. Brap? No thanks, Brap. I already have peanuts. <laughs> Charlie Brown, will you never learn? We have to help Brap fit in here. You're right. I mean, we can't just stick her in a crate and mail her back to the jungle. Can we? This is gonna sound crazy. Really crazy. But I think Brap might be attracted to you. <laughs> wow, that sounded even crazier coming out of my mouth than it did inside my head. You think Brap likes me? <laughs> that makes sense. I freed her so she sees me as the strong, powerful, heroic figure that I am. Out of the This glue is hot! Water! I need water! <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Excuse me. Pardon me. Would you mind? I'm trying to get through. <laughs> Thank you, Brap. Whoa! <laughs> oh, she thinks she's gonna miss you. Really? Because all I heard was Brap. <laughs> Boys need everything spelled out for them in words. didn't even glance my way. What does it mean? And somebody spelled out for me in words. OK, class, today we're going to learn about, here you go, one derby dog with extra mustard. <laughs> derby, what are you doing? I'm with a customer at the moment. If you go to the back of the line, wait your turn like everyone else, I'll be happy to serve you. But I'm about to teach a lesson. A good lesson might be arrive early and you won't end up at the back of the line. I'll have the low cow, no fat, zero carb, sugar-free derby dog. Here you go. Thank goodness I'm starving. <laughs> Excuse me. Derby, you're selling food in my school? I guess the students no longer do not have no choice. <laughs> that means you do have a choice. Oh. Well, this is not unoutrageous. I'm gonna unlose back every last one of these customers. <laughs> okay. We need to teach Brap to say something other than Brap. Brap. So far, you've learned more elephant than she's learned English. Brap. Brap. Adam. Brap. Brap loves Adam. Brap loves Adam? <laughs> that very bad. No, Slab, you don't understand. No, you're not unwrong. I do don't not not understand. <laughs> now I don't understand. You stole my girl. I'm going to break you into pieces and then put you back together a little bit wrong. <laughs> That I understand. Do you mind holding these? Actually, that's a lot of... Help! I don't not need help! You're going out with Brap? She's the perfect woman. She doesn't need to fill silences with meaningless talk. Brap should be with me. You're right. As in not wrong? 
so you're not not uninterested in her. <laughs> that sounds like you think she's not perfect. <laughs> How dare you say that about my woman? No, 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 she's amazing, but clearly perfect for you. And I like somebody else. You? I never see you talking to girls. Ever. Like, never. It's true. The only girl you ever talked to is me. Slap, I'm really not interested in Brav. Then why are you spending so much time with her? She's just a little confused right now. She thinks Adam's strong and powerful. <laughs> <laughs> My little Brappy. So confused. Anyway, you just need to show Brap how much you two have in common. Thank you for spelling that out for me in words. <laughs> it feels good to help somebody. Hello? Ivy? You're here too? I know it's not like me to be in the science room or to be eating visible food. But this place was rated one of the top two restaurants in the school. <laughs> Mr. Tater, are you gonna order anything? If not, I'm gonna have to ask you to leave. And please, don't even think of violating his no shirt, no service policy. I don't know why this place is so busy, especially with your C health rating. <laughs> it's because of the promotion we're having. Buy a dog, Get a free drink. <laughs> Buy a dog, get a free order of fries. <laughs> Buy a dog, get a free dog. <laughs> Buy a dog, get a free dog. That's exactly the same deal I'm offering. No, it's not. Chili dog instead? <laughs> okay, Brav, time for a lesson in being human. You're gonna learn how to walk like a lady. Heel toe, heel toe. Yeah. See how they make you look taller, your legs look shapelier, give you better posture, and that extra little boost of confidence you just need so badly someday? <laughs> Now you try. Heel toe, shoulders back. <laughs> hmm. Maybe we should have started you with something easier, like a wedge. <laughs> Slab, what are you doing? Showing Brab I'm the perfect man for her. Uh oh. Brab, be careful. You uh -oh. might get hit by. Uh -oh. <laughs> Thanks for the soft landing. <laughs> she likes him even more now. Don't worry. You'll win her over. I don't know. Adam's just got that extra little boost of confidence about him. Ivy, you're working for Derby now? Oh, I know this seems like a degrading place to work, but I needed the job. I'm saving up for college. Good for you. Education is important. College is the name of this new store at the mall. <laughs> All right, Brap, time to learn how to eat like a human. <laughs> Humans don't eat with their hands. First, we cut a piece of food. Then, we take the fork like so and guide it into our mouths. See how I'm chewing with my mouth closed? <laughs> now, to wash down our food, we take a sip from our drink like this. You try. Brap, that's great!
Hey, everyone. <laughs> What's new? Rap? Oh, this old thing? Elephants can't resist a peanut. They're not the only ones. A squirrel just crawled up your shell. <laughs> Stop this love. You're gonna make me. I think you're sending her a mixed message. What human activity are you teaching Brack now? Hygiene. <laughs> It's not going as quickly as I had hoped. Maybe we should stop trying to make her bed in with humans. She's an elephant at heart. I think she would be happier with her own kind. Her own kind? Where are we gonna find other people raised by elephants? I mean actual elephants. Maybe the circus. I'm sure given a little more time, I can teach her to fit in and reconnect her with her humanity. <laughs> Inspector, treat him nicely. I'm trying to get us up to a C plus. I can't do everything. You need to hire another waitress. Where am I gonna find another cute girl? <laughs> okay, it's actually working out. Mr. Tater, come to eat crow. We don't actually serve crow. Actually, I hear your food is delicious and your service impeccable. I'd like a meal. Table for one, please. Wow, how many times in your life have you said that? shopping trip to college. An actual college if I wanted. <laughs> Where'd that mouse come from? It's from the cafeteria. That place is crawling with them. <laughs> Closed by order of the health inspector. Looks like we're both out of business. Too bad, I'm really hungry. I'll whip something up for you. <laughs> okay, I told the circus we have a great act for them. I'm just worried Brad won't want to go. Don't worry. <laughs> she will when I, as a fellow elephant, nudge her away from the herd. Where is Brad? Brappy. Slab? <laughs> I'm dressed like this to attract Brap. I see you had the same idea. I knew you were lying when you said you weren't interested in her. No, nope, Slab, it's not what you think. We're gonna settle this once and for all. Let the battle for dominance begin! <laughs> Yikes. Maybe I'll get a pair, too. Ivy? Brap? What did you do to her? Oh, her name's not Brap anymore. Call me Brianna. That's with three N's. Ivy, you taught Brap English? 
I've been working with her on language acquisition and getting nowhere. And we're supposed to be shocked that you're a bad teacher? <laughs> Crap. I defeated another elephant in battle, making me the dominant male. Do you want to go out sometime? I thought you liked her because she was so different from other girls. Yeah, but look at her. <laughs> so what do you say? Uh, I say no. Because she still sees me as a strong, powerful, heroic figure. Uh, extra no. Sorry, guys, but clearly you're both total dorks. I taught her so well. <laughs> You ruined my chances with Brat. <laughs> Not again. <laughs> Get back here, long-nosed dog version of Mr. Young. I'm here. Where's this great circus act? Uh. <laughs> Miniature elephants? I don't know why, but this appeals to me. See that seal? Balancing the ball on her nose? Yeah, really cute. Hey, I saw her first. She's mine. Quiet, <laughs> <Buy it>, elephants! <laughs>